It's Bonnie. Happy Wednesday. I am back. I am back with a whole lot of soap. Oh my goodness, you guys. We got to sort this mess out. We are on day 10 of Bath and Body Works semi-annual sale. I feel like semi-annual sale is just gone. I feel like this is just like the fastest semi-annual sale um, that we've had in years. Um, online is just not exciting. They literally have one soap uh, for $1.87. It is the watermelon lemonade. I'm like, one? That's all we have? Um, the most exciting thing online right now uh, is the whipped rose and vanilla shower gel um, and the pink lily and bamboo, blackberry and basil. For three thirty-seven, I just think this is like probably um, the thing you'd want to pick up if you want to pick up anything online. I'm waiting it out a little bit longer to see if we can get some better deals. Um, the three seventy-five soap online uh, for Christmas—that is not a good deal. We gotta wait till that goes down um, even more because I'm like, no, that is that is not a good deal. Uh, they did have Japanese cherry blossom in the uh, whipped body butter. I noticed that was uh, sold out, though. At my store, I forgot to mention, uh, we did have some aromatherapy on sale for 75% off, and I'm seeing it now online, the vanilla patchouli. So, um, yeah, we wait. The retro 90s collection is still half off. I'm like, they need to just dump that over because this weekend is when we should start seeing the new stuff. So um, I get kind of motivated to do uh, some more organization today. Check it out. I have got too much soap, <laughs> which is no surprise. Actually, I've pared it down a lot, by the way. Um, from years ago, which is good. Oh, by the way, I also got this at Dollar Tree yesterday. It fell on the floor and I didn't get to show you guys. Um, it's kind of pricey for one sponge, but yet less expensive uh, than a lot of places. But I thought that was cute. I got a heart-shaped sponge. So um, I have a bin here. I have two bins. I have my mostly Christmas bin here. I keep this in the bathroom on a shelf, like in the main bathroom. Um, and I'm trying to get through all of this because it's all Christmas soap. And then I thought this was all I had. And then I walk into um, my husband's bathroom that he mostly uses that's attached to our bedroom. And I'm like, where, where, where did this come from? <laughs> Like, I didn't even know I had this soap. Do you ever do this? You like find soap and you're like, wait a minute. So I'm going to show you what's in these bins. And I'm doing a serious use it up. I'm going to try and do uh, some empties videos at the end of the month. My problem is I always forget to save the container. I got a like a bin now. So I'm going to try and do an empties video because I know a lot of people love the empties video. So I'm going to try really hard to do that. But mostly I have soap in my empties. We go through a lot of soaps. So I'm going to go through this first. I did buy a couple of the new soaps uh, for semi annual sale. I'm going to show you these first. I got the Mango Mai Tai. I got the, um, the White Waves, which I'm not super crazy about, but I thought it was pretty. And then uh, Limoncello is an amazing... Uh, Kitchen soap. I love this one. Oh, it smells good. It's kind of like kitchen lemon. Um, anything lemon in the kitchen's great. And then I got um, the strawberry soda, which I really like. This is the fresh strawberries, bubbly seltzer, and crushed ice. Oh, that smells so good. I think I'm going to save these, though, um, and use up my Christmas stuff first. I got other stuff in here. So <laughs> check it out. I have a Elderflower Gin Fizz. This is actually really pretty. This came out in the fall, I think. Bubbly Prosecco, Elderflower Blooms, and Sparkling Blackberries. I forgot to use this one. Um, it's very dry. I think I'm going to put this one in the bathroom, though. So that's cute. Um, I have a perfect pumpkin left over from Halloween. I didn't realize I had so much Halloween soap. I think I overbought. I have Sugared Spell. Um, you can actually pop these in like a soap holder if you're not in the mood to like look at Halloween. And then the scents are good. I have a oh, winter citrus wreath. I might send a couple of these to my mother-in-law. I'm not a huge fan of winter citrus wreath. I have um, the coconut pumpkin latte. I'll probably use that up in the kitchen. I have, oh, sweet whiskey. I got a sweet whiskey in here. I didn't even know I had this. <laughs> like, yay. I like sweet whiskey. 
Oh yeah, that smells really good in the soap. I love the shower gel too. Those are not on sale yet. It's semi-annual. They're still 50% off. Um, golden citrus and vanilla. That's a good one for summer or spring. I have a ghoul friend. I have a, oh, autumn s'mores. That one will work in the kitchen. I have a, oh, a frosted cranberry. And I have a white coconut caramel left. That's not bad. Okay, so let me set this one down. Let me see what I have in this other one. This is the big one. I'm like, oh my gosh, I have a lot of soap. Because I'm going to be buying all the spring soap. I always do. I like to do reviews on it. Um, so I got to get through some of this soap. I have uh, a strawberry snowflakes. This is going, I think, out first. This one smelled so good in the soap. I like this. It's so funny because we're all like moved into spring here and it's like totally not even <laughs> January like 5th. Uh, this was actually pretty uh, for a winter motif. I can't do winter right now. I don't know why. I'm just not in the mood for winter. Um, glistening gumdrops. This is the spiced orange one that I loved so much. I had a couple of these. This uh, this would make a great body care. It's like a spicy orange. Um, I have a oh, toasted vanilla chai. I have... Oh, I just bought this one. Uh, this is the pink lilac and vanilla. Uh, this is actually kind of Valentine's Day. I should save this one. Oh, that smells so good. A little closer to spring. Like I said, I'm trying to use up all of my Christmas stuff. I have a spiced apricot uh, cider. That's kind of year round. I have oh, another perfect pumpkin. Oh my gosh, I totally bought too much Halloween. Too much. Um, pumpkin cupcake. That's a good one for the kitchen. That's kind of all season. Oh, I have the deep cleansing strawberry soda. I want to do a comparison um, soon of this deep cleansing versus the regular, just to kind of give you guys an idea of the different formulas and how is it different from um, the regular cleansing gel, which by the way, I have, I have a vampire blood. Um, oh, Stardust Magic. This does not look super Halloween-y to me. Uh, this was Celestial Caramel Swirl, Mystical Vanilla and Secret Musk. This can be used in the bathroom. That smells good. That smells really good. Um, let's see here. Oh, I have a blueberry donut. I didn't even know I had this. Oh, that smells so good. We need blueberry donut back. That one's good. Oops, I got it on my hand. Um, we have a champagne toast. That's year round. I have a Christmas coconut brittle. I had to have this one. I remember when I bought this and I'm like, oh, Christmas coconut brittle. And I didn't even put it out. That smells good though. We can use this now. That is fine. Oh, pumpkin apple. I always like to have an extra pumpkin apple on hand. Oh my gosh. Oh, that smells so good. I'm so in the mood for pumpkin apple. Even like in the spring, sometimes I'll just be like, I gotta smell pumpkin apple. Um, gingerbread bakery is a good spring one. Oh, I got it on my nose. Um, oh, I cinnamon rolls. This will work for uh, winter. Um, vanilla bean Noel. That's fine. That's a good one. Uh, what do I have? Oh, I have a Kraken Me Up of Cozy Vanilla Almond <laughs> with, the, um, with the Nutcracker. A little Christmassy there. Oh, I have, what is this? Oh, I have leaves. Oh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give this one off. I am not a huge fan. Oh my gosh, that's way too strong. Leaves and I don't get along really well. Not one of my favorite scents. Oh, Strawberry Snowflakes. I didn't know I had this in the cleansing uh, gel. I got to do a comparison on those. I have iced cinnamon rolls in the gel. I have a, a fresh balsam. I don't know if I can use fresh balsam now, you guys. It's just too Christmassy. You know, it's funny. I usually like tip over, like I said, around like January 4th, 5th and like, nope, can't do balsam. Can't do super strong cinnamon. Twisted peppermint. I can do twisted peppermint. That's a good one. Uh, oh, fresh cut lilacs. Where did this go? Like, where did this come from? It's still got the plastic seal on it. I must have bought that last year. And then I have, oh, I have a Wicked Apple from like a year and a half ago, two years ago. That was a good one. I hope they bring Wicked Apple back. So, um, how many do I have? I have uh, 3, 6, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38. I got like 39. That's not bad for me. <laughs> Honestly, at one point, I think I did a video and I had like a whole cart. I had like a hundred hand soaps. I've been good, you guys. I have been so good. I'm trying to um, 
only buy like one so I can review it for everybody. And then I kind of move on and then go to the next season. So that's kind of my plan going forward. So I don't like over soap myself. (laughs) But anyway, we do use a lot of soap. I don't know. I am like, I use like five or six pumps. I am terrible. I use a ton of soap, but I got a ton of soap. So it all works out well. Anyway, um, pick up some bins and uh, organize your soap so that uh, you know what you have. Put them somewhere where you can see them. Don't stuff them in the linen closet because I made that mistake one year and then I went in my linen closet. And I'm like, where did this soap come from? And it does tend to get a little icky after about like two or three years, I noticed. I don't like to keep soap past like a year because I think the color changes and the texture changes and it gets a little gross. So Use up your soap. It's meant to be used. And then uh, we will all enjoy enjoy the new soaps that are coming soon. Semi-annual sale day 10 is kind of a dud. Hopefully we get some more uh, good stuff tomorrow. We shall see. Hopefully the 90s collection's on sale even more. I will see you guys later. Bye-bye.